Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel. If you have not subscribed, please subscribe so you can be notified when I go live or upload a new video. And please like this video. I want to first start off by saying that I appreciate you guys so much for staying with me. Um, I appreciate you guys more than you will ever know. So let's go ahead and get in this video. Now as you guys know that I am starting a series. It's called End Time Prophecy. Um, series that where we start we are going to dig in and dive into the book of Daniel and then also in, then into the book of Revelations if anybody knows that it's really important you know that when we get into the study of end time prophecy it's important to start with the book of Daniel or yeah the book of Daniel before we get into the book of revelations so in this very first video we are not going to start the study in this video this video is just basically a short introduction into the book of daniel and so this video will not be very long it's just like i said it's just an introduction and then we will start in chapter one with the very next video so let's go ahead and start this now the book of daniel contains some of the best known stories in the bible but it also provides some of the most challenging and intriguing passages to attempt to comprehend some of the prophets had sent warning of a judgment of god's people to come others are present at the end of the captivity to help encourage and empower the exiles but daniel goes into exile along with his countrymen and provides an insider's view of judah's experiences in the faraway land of babylon now daniel he came from a a noble royal family he is compared pretty much with Noah and Job in terms of faithfulness to God and righteousness. In Ezekiel, I know in Ezekiel, let's see, 14, 14, it says, though these three men, Noah, Daniel, and Job were in it, they should deliver but their own souls by the righteousness, said the Lord God. So, Daniel describes mm -hmm. events that occurred during the worst situations the people of God ever experienced. The nation of Israel had fallen to the Assyrians more than 100 years earlier. But Ju Judah survived. Yet the people of Judah continued to refuse to heed God's warning and soon faced humiliating defeat themselves. The Babylonians breached the walls of Jerusalem, ransacked the temple, and carried off most of the population in a series of deportations. Daniel was among the first group taken. His writings offer much assurance and that even though circumstances look really bad, God is still with his people. So we all know that Daniel, he was one of the first to be exiled. He was the first to be deported and taken into Babylon. Nebuchadnezzar, he was just conquering them and taking them into captivity. And so the story of Daniel, it get, it's going to get extremely interesting. It's going to be filled with, you know, um, a lot of imagery offering hope to Israelites, the living, you know, that are living in exile under this Babylonian rule. Uh, Daniel, as we know, he remains faith, faithful to God. 
to the one God of Israel while he is maintaining an influence in the surrounding culture of Babylon. Daniel lived in captivity along with his the friends that are Shadrach, Shadrach Meshach, and Abednego. You know, although they faced pressures to conform to Babylon, Babylonian society and give up the ways of their people they stood strong in their faith and so therefore God blessed Daniel with all of this wisdom and the ability to be able to interpret these dreams for Nebuchadnezzar and so a lot of the dreams that Daniel was having related to end time prophecy and the same <clears throat> with John in the book of Revelations and so we need to really get into this study and try to understand the things that are coming and very soon so with that being said I will be uploading the very first video to the book of Daniel chapter 1 and we will do a very in-depth study of this book before we get into the book of Revelations because again it's it's very important that we get into the book of Daniel before we even touch on the book of Revelations so if you guys have any questions, please leave them in the comment section. And God bless you. And I hope you guys stay with me and enjoy these videos in the series. God bless.